one word. One word. Yeah. One word. Yeah. Two. Two, two syllables. syllables. Yeah. yeah. First word, okay. No, first syllable. The first syllable. Uh, uh, snap. S- snapping. Snap. Fingers. Clock. Look. Tongue. Clicking noise. Click. 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 Okay. Oh, okay. Second, Second word. word. Yeah. Fishing. Uh, fish. Fishing. Give us a better hint. Uh, uh, screwing. S- screwing. Bait. 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 Clickbait. Oh, okay. Clickbait. It's clickbait. The title's clickbait. I do not have a superiority complex. I don't think anybody in this world should. Even even over quarantine when we saw celebrities just do normal celebrity things. You know? They're also boring. Humans in general are boring. <laughs> They're boring. I got this video idea. I was scrolling on Twitter and I saw this. This. Oh, Uh-oh. God. Oh, Yikes. no. I hated it. And because I'm bad at explaining things, it is going to sound like I have a superiority complex. One of those things that I just mentioned. But I'm trying to say that no one is special for doing these things. Like, you need to be you need to be doing remarkable things to be considered special. That's what I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. So I first wanted to talk about the divide on TikTok that made me leave the app. Um, <clears throat> admittedly, I did say my goodbyes to TikTok because I th- thought it was getting shut down in Australia and I wanted to rip the band-aid off and then it didn't even get banned, it was fine. But there was a divide before that um, between straight and gay TikTok and then gay TikTok got renamed. But yeah, like the comments, especially on videos would be like, if, you, if you're if you here, you're on elite TikTok and then everyone in the comments would be like... Oh, thank God. <laughs> and before I left the app, I was not... I should explain the side, shouldn't I? According to Urban Dictionary, straight TikTok is mostly hype house, dances, and POVs. Okay, that one hurt because I used to do POVs. More on that later. It is very boring, and if you are on straight TikTok, you are probably boring. <laughs> you can be straight and not be on straight TikTok. Okay. All TikTok is... <laughs> Divined as the good side of TikTok. It's filled with punks, people who love music, fashion, and all that other artsy stuff. Alt people, gay people, and goths. There's actually funny and high quality content on alt TikTok. There's no hype house, no verified creators, no cringe, and no thirst traps. Did you see that new TikTok that generic white guy number one made with generic white guy number two? Uh, no, I'm on an alt TikTok. People think they're better than other people if they use, like, certain phrases, which usually is just stolen from black Twitter anyways. It was just basically straight people accusing other straight people of being straight. And it was, it was like that's the spider, you know what I'm talking about, the Spider-Man meme? If you're confident in your personality and your sense of humor, you don't feel the need to, you know, prove it. <laughs> so that's my rant on that. <laughs> that's that on that. There was also the main character phase, which was also fucking annoying. It was basically... I mean, there were, cute, there were cute videos from it. There were people like, yeah, I'm the main character, and then they'd like dance in the rain. I liked those. That was, it was cute when it first started. But then, videos of people being like, if you wear Nikes, or you shop at this shop, or you listen to this artist, then you're not the main character. And it was like, oh, honey. It was basically like a sub-genre of alt TikTok at that point. It was like a way to further divide yourself. So at first, we were watching people live their best lives. People would post like compilations, be like, I am the main character. And all the comics would be like, yes, you are. And then it just turned into gatekeeping. What TikTok does best. If we've been talking about, what did I talk about first? Oh, uh, old TikTok versus straight TikTok. And then we talked about the main character. Those are the lesser evils. Um, The real common enemy is... If I had the opportunity, I would gather every single young girl with internalized misogyny and I would tell her to knock it off. I'd tell her to look at other women and admire them uh, and not compare yourself to them. And I would also tell them that fighting over a little crusty boy who doesn't respect women, that it's never going to be worth it, I would. I would do that. I genuinely believe that... Pretty much every girl, good on you if you haven't, but every girl has to go through an internalized misogyny phase and it's dumb and it should be a step we skip because it's just a hold of just comparing ourselves and insecurities and it do- it's not necessary because women are great and they're not the problem with your own insecurities.
if you would like to join, I'm actually CEO of the Woman Fan Club. I love so many of them, and I admire so many of them, and I um, try to, like, be like so many of them. But yeah, if you've heard of the I'm Not Like Other Girls thing, complex, it's basically just I am different and other women are bad by default. And I don't like that because uh, most of the time they are pretty boring people to talk to. They give themselves too much credit and see what I mean? Like my wording is going to make me sound like I have a superiority complex, but I do not. Don't think anybody is above anybody else. Um, <laughs> few exceptions. Donald Trump, Caitlin Bennett, uh, many others that I cannot currently think of, but there are bad people in this world. I'm just saying no one should think that they're better because they have different interests in life or different vocabulary. The only people who rightfully should have superiority complexes but don't are like Harry Styles and and Harry Styles. Basically my conclusion for this video is don't think you're God. Don't think you're God. Don't put yourself above others because that's just weird and it's um, cringe and we're past the need for that. Do things that make you happy and make you feel like you have a purpose but don't think that your purpose is more meaningful than other people's purposes. Thank you for listening. If you like this video, um, like it. You know, like I know how you, I know you liked it, but li like physically like it. Um, subscribe if you like me. If you think I'm God, yeah. I'll see you next time. Bye bye. <laughs>